Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Meek's Journey, Planner Girl Meek on Instagram, also Meek's Journey on Instagram. Here I am showing you a kit that I made myself last year. Um, it was a very tedious thing to do and I tried to do my best. I think I made about four or five kits last year and um, yeah. And then I also showed you the stickers from my freebie that you get when you use Planner Girl Meek um, in the notes section and you get 35% off in the Planner Shack if you use Planner Girl Meek 35. But here I am just placing down the boxes um, in their places and I am as I'm doing this I'm like man I made a lot of mistakes when I made this kit because the dimensions of everything was off and but I think I think this was one of my first kits maybe one of my first Christmas kits so I think I did pretty good um, but I'm just putting everything together and I will do the perfecting of it later um, I got this kit from, oh my goodness, what is her name on Instagram? Not Instagram, Etsy. I will try to leave a link down below where I got this artwork. A lot of sticker shops used it. Um, and this was before COVID and homeschool when I had time to like put stuff together and I love creating stuff and I just put this together and I really really enjoyed it and what's crazy is I think I don't think I ever used it last year this is my first time using the kit that I created it was really exciting um, but yeah I'm sorry if I am not speaking loud enough I am dealing with a, I don't want to say sore throat just an achy throat it's a lot better than it was which is why this video is so late but um, yeah I'm getting better just I went outside one day and it was cold <laughs> I was out in the front yard fixing the Christmas decoration that had fallen and yeah and here here goes the sore throat so I have been in the house since then um, yeah but I'm just trying to get the sizing of this box together because like I said I <laughs> the perfecting of this kit when I put it together was not done correctly <laughs> and I'm putting my date dots on and now as I'm doing this kit I was like "Ooh, I don't know if I like is it too dark like is it Christmassy colors and it's kind of like a farmhouse theme if you think about it like the colors give me farmhouse vibes so I stuck with it but I kept thinking am I gonna change my mind and I'm sorry if y'all can hear me drinking my hot cocoa <laughs> my throat is like girl stop talking right now <laughs> what are you doing but yeah it's just I like talking to y'all but here I am marking down that my son had a reading test. Um, they do K-12, if you've seen my K-12 video, it is posted. My kids are in K-12 homeschool, which you would think that there wouldn't be that much work involved for the parents, but it, we're pretty much teaching them. So yeah, um, he had a reading test that morning and I marked that down and he did so good on his test. I'm so proud of him. My kids are doing such a good job and I'm happy that they're doing good. On Tuesday, I'm marking down that I had a Walmart run, but that will change because I did not go to Walmart that Tuesday. Um, my husband's work schedule changed and I think I ended up going on Thursday, which is the same day that the Santa Mickey fell down in the yard and I went out and picked him up and then I was out shopping and it was a whole ordeal <laughs> but here I am marking down that I got some stuff off of Amazon um, for Christmas and I'm also marking down that I started my recording on Monday for the silhouette plan with me um, so what I did differently with this kit and I was able to fill in more 
um, I recorded each day. I think I did two days at a time on some days, but I just, I would stop and I would come back the next day and fill in what I had did for that day. And I love planning like that. I don't know. Are you guys on the go planners? Are you plan as you go? Or do you like to just plan out your week? And if something changes around, you can just put it in your planner later that that didn't happen. But I loved planning this way. I'm actually going to start today because today is Monday working on this week's plan with me, which hopefully I will get that one out before the new year. I should because we have a couple of more days before the new year. So that Christmas one will be out. I had intended on doing a sing along (laughs) for that plan with me. I am not sure I'm going to be able to do it because of my voice my throat is sore and the more I'm talking now the more my throat is like swelling up Ugh, it's horrible y'all but we're gonna pray in Jesus name that I get better um because yeah I want to I want to do a sing-along for Christmas but here I'm marking down um that I I think I was watching YouTube on Thursday I was either watching YouTube on Thursday or I was checking stats um, my YouTube stats trying to see if that other video the monthly got to 100 yet and it's getting close I think once it gets to 75 I'm gonna go ahead and release that template I will link that video down below so you guys can watch it watch it again watch it multiple times so we can get that template out to you guys because a lot of you have been asking like when are you gonna release the template I'm like I am trying to get that video to a hundred but if we get it to 75 I will be happy because I did a reel on this um, video and it's almost at 200 views so I think it's just the YouTube algorithm But on Tuesday, I marked down that the homeschool system was not working and ugh, it gave me such a migraine because it throws off my timing. And I marked on there with my script, can't today. And I used one of the girls from my freebie sheet that said migraine on her shirt. Very, very real. (laughs) Here I am marking that I have become a part of the Toyo Tress. Um, It's a hair company. Um, I do still plan on doing hair videos. I actually have to do one next week. Um, But I became a part of their um, influencer team, which is a PR team. Um, And I'm really, really excited about that. And at first I was like, I don't know if I want to do it. But I was like, well, at least my hair will always be done. So I guess I should do it. So I'm trying it out. um, And I was really excited about that to join the team and to be able to to do more hair videos that's going to be really exciting (laughs) but I know you guys are here for planner stuff so you don't have to watch those um, hair videos but I would greatly appreciate it (laughs) but now I am marking down that I I had to pay a bill there was a bill that I forgot to pay and I was like oh lord it is the 15th um this bill need to be paid I think I got up at like six o'clock in the morning and paid that bill I was like girl if you don't get it together (laughs) so I think I marked that on a different day but um yeah and then I'm also marking that I got happy mail I think yep I got happy mail um my birthday purchases were starting to to come in and I don't remember what I got I'm trying to think because I know I got another one on Sunday (laughs) excuse me y'all lord I'm trying (laughs) y'all I got um I got my planner covers from stylish planners because she's only doing digital now so I grabbed two of them from her shop because I love her planner covers so much this day I was tired on Wednesday and I wrote my script in there girl (laughs) because I was tired but I still had to get up and get that work done get homeschool done excuse me here I am I am changing the dimensions of this gift. The box around it is too big, which will make everything else difficult. 
So I am doing the select and trace so I can get rid of that big box that's around it. If you guys want a further detail on how I did that, it's pretty much how you can make a sticker or how you can pull an image out of a bigger sticker. I know you're like, what? <laughs> if you're like me, just do a tutorial, just let me know. I have a list of things that you guys have asked me to do and I can't wait to get them out to you. Um, but here I'm marking that I went and bought presents and I think I'm actually going to move that to Friday. Um, and here I was actually marking stuff down in my weekend banner. Like my week was so full. I was like, I can't leave this blank for my washi banner. Oh no. <laughs> What's going on? Um, it was a busy week. It's the week before Christmas. So yeah, I'm marking here that Sunday. Um, I had to do a Facebook post because it was day seven of the 12 days of giveaway. And um, I actually just chose my winner. Congratulations. Um, it was really cool. I think I I asked them to name their must-see Christmas movie. Mine is Miracle on 34th Street. And I've only seen the 1994 version. It is my favorite movie. I think I've seen it at least 100 times. Um, but I think this year I might actually watch the older version. I don't know. We'll see. But there I'm marking that I got my stylish planner covers in. And that Sunday I had an every intention on posting my plan with me on Sunday but I was telling the PR girls my son was talking the entire time I was trying to do this voiceover and it just was not happening and I said okay when I get up in the morning and after I teach my classes I'm just going to do my voiceover and call it a day because <laughs> Lord Jesus um, here I am writing down that Christmas break has begun. The kids are not in school. They get two weeks off. Lord help me. They don't go back till January 4th, y'all. Girl. But here, this is another one. Um, I need to make the box smaller. So when I select stuff, it won't select that with it. It's complicated. I should have did it when I was creating this kit, but I didn't. Um, so I'm just pulling it all together, just doing some extra design work, I guess you could say. Um, but that sticker was giving me a headache. It would move. You see that? I had to break it apart <laughs> and put it together piece by piece. It was such a headache. I'm like, all this for a cookie. <laughs> so, um, this was a difficult, a difficult, um, deco. That's what I want to say. Um, but it finally came together. Trial and error. That's that's what it is. And I'm just placing a wreath there and the sweaters. And yeah, I'm just placing everything down, getting it all pretty. Um, but yeah, I think this is the busiest my week has been in my planner layout. It normally ends up like this anyway at the end of the week. But this time, because I was able to plan as I go because I'm doing a digital plan with me um it just made it it just made it and it just looks so much better for me I don't know about y'all but I just I love planning like this and I love that everyone is enjoying planning this way I love it when you guys post on Facebook in the Facebook group and you post on Instagram and you tag me and it just make it makes my day it's just it makes me want to keep creating things to share um, it's just I love it so much so I really appreciate that and I'm glad you guys like it here I am marking down uh, my Shakeology um, whether or not I had them every day and I actually didn't have it the other day and that's probably why my throat bothering me now I need to get get it together and drink my Shakeology. It's a diet shake. It helps carve cravings. <laughs> so I will be drinking a Shakeology on Christmas so I won't eat too many sweets. Um, but it's really good. Um, and then here I am marking down that the sickness took a toll and I was like, I just can't today. I just had to chill out, take some medicine. Because girl, it was a sick day. I took off work. I was supposed to work Friday and Saturday and I was like mm -mm, I can't do it I'm I'm done for the day that this is gonna be it for me <laughs> my favorite little sleepy girl there um, but yeah 
Yeah, it was a Netflix and chill kind of day. Although I don't think I left that Netflix there. I'm always moving stuff around. Yeah, are y'all hard headed like me? Like, I'm sick, right? I should be in the bed and I'm doing laundry. <laughs> My husband's like, you're resting, right? Yeah, mm -hmm, I'm I'm resting. It's it's one of the things that me and my sisters all have in common. Like we know we need to sit down and relax, but when something needs to be done, you're like, why put it off when I know I can do it now? So I'm just gonna go ahead and do it. <laughs> but I shouldn't have been doing laundry. Um, I think I actually had to rewash those clothes because I fell asleep. And that um. That NyQuil ain't no joke, y'all. But, yes. Um, I did start my laundry, and I finished it on Sunday. Um, well, I haven't folded my clothes yet. <laughs> but here I am just putting in the finishing touches. Just a little deco. And we are almost there. We are almost there, y'all. Um, Thursday I marked my social media post this is a whole nother day um, like I said this was a span of probably about four or five days that I kept coming back on adding to this and now I'm just moving things over so I can group everything together you guys know how I do it and then I will do the perfecting on another page here you see that big box that's what I was talking about making the kit smaller so I didn't do it for one of the stickers and I kept picking up that huge box there <laughs> so um, that won't happen in my next plan with me that's why it, that's why it took me so long to do this one I had to fix a lot of corrections but I got it done and it came out really really good and it was it was really cool to use a kit that I made which is odd for me um, but here, you guys know what I do. I go in and I check my settings, make sure that it will fit in my planner. Um, and if I have to move anything closer together, I will. But here, I can tell right away that it will work. Um, and it's going to look good. So I'm putting it back to the letter size. And I think I'm going to make a few slight changes. Um, I'm just putting my print dimensions there. I don't know why that cut line is so far up. I just noticed that. Like, why is it all the way up there? Hmm. I didn't notice that. I'll have to check that in my settings later. But there's a big gap at the bottom. You see that? Like, why? Why? Maybe because of the cut machine? dimensions maybe that's why y'all I'm sorry I'm rambling <laughs> I am actually talking like I'm having a conversation with y'all and I fully expect for y'all to be like girl yes <laughs> but here I am just perfecting everything because I do yes I print this out and then I pull it apart as stickers I think all together it's about seven stickers it's less than ten that I use um, and it actually saves on the wear and tear of your cut machine so yes, um, but I try to pull it together to where it actually looks like a spread because I do take this and save it as a JPEG um, and put it in my digital planner. And I will try to upload that video on Instagram. I think I did do a video of me putting this in my planner and I will try to put that on Instagram for you in my Insta story or reels. Um, but yeah, so here I changed my plan with me to silhouette plan with me. And um, yeah, I'm definitely going to keep that as a script. I really love that. And I am just, you know, putting things together, making sure they don't move. Um, you don't have to do this part, but for me, it just lets me know that everything's together. And if I make any movements, it won't move. Um, so look, look at that. Y'all, I was struggling because my, my boxes were so big. <laughs> because that box there with the sweater and the shoes I actually made that so there's clip art attached to that box um, so I didn't there was I, I skipped a lot of steps because I did it for myself so yeah girl 
it was it was a whole it was a whole thing but it's cute <laughs> but okay y'all I am blabbering on and on and on this is the end please please like comment and subscribe please like the video it really helps my channel and I forever forever truly thank you all for following me thank you for being on this journey with me thank you for 500 subscribers on Instagram yes shout out to y'all I truly appreciate everything and yeah like comment and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one. Have a Merry Christmas, everyone. And I will see you guys next week. Um, be chatting with you. Okay, guys. Merry Christmas. Thank you for watching. Bye.